Levi Coffin was an abolitionist. He started helping slaves when he was young. One day, Levi Coffin saw chained slaves walk past him while he chopped wood. When the slaves came closer, he asked them where they were going. They replied by saying that they were going off to be sold. This is when Levi Coffin started to help slaves. Unlike most people of his time, he strongly opposed slavery and tried his best to help slaves. Levi Coffin helped slaves escape to Canada for 20 years. He successfully helped over 2,000 slaves. None of the slaves he helped got caught while they were in Newport. I soon became extensively known to the friends of slaves at different points on the Ohio River where fugitives generally crossed and to those northward of us on the various routes leading to Canada. Levi Coffin. Levi Coffin hid many fugitives of slaves in his house in Indiana. His house had several secret hiding places for the slaves. Levi Coffin also opened a warehouse in Cincinnati that only sold slave labor free goods. He also hid some slaves in this warehouse. I knew she had run away, and I was going to do my part to help her along, Jenny Patterson, to be a slave. Levi Coffin was so successful that many African Americans in Cincinnati, after his death, erected a monument over his grave. Oprah Winfrey is like Levi Coffin. She helps people who are in need of food, shelter, and all other basic necessities. Oprah made a school for girls in Africa for this purpose. 